Welcome back to CM and Jack because Steam Fortress Gunslinger. Hell on Earth. I'm thinking we might move back down to us uh, suicidal and then do two rounds or two games because uh, we're dying a lot on the Hell on Earth. I don't, I don't think the last one was. I mean, the last one was definitely my fault, but like that would have happened on suicidal as well. So I'm not really blaming myself for that one. I'm not blaming the Hell on Earth for that one, rather I suppose. Um, I am definitely blaming myself. And even if it's Hell on Earth's fault, like, I could have been better, right? But, like, it's just, I'm not, I don't, I don't think that was me not being able to cope with the difficulty of Hell on Earth. I think that was me not being able to cope with the Matriarch, which is an entirely separate, but, uh, equal problem. I just did the, uh, the Yuppie Psycho. Uh, Yamachek tries. That game is weird, man. I don't get it. It's uh, it's fun, but it's, it's weird, man. It's uh, it's like some weird horror game thing, and uh, I don't I don't do horror very well, so it was actually like pretty pretty freaky. I um I have Alien Isolation in my in my unplayed list as well. I have play I have uh, seen I uh, watched Good Boulderfest uh, play through Alien Isolation and. That was that was good fun watching him play through that. Uh, so I know what happens and I kind of get the idea of it, um, but we might still do it eventually. I'm unsure if we're ever gonna do a proper horror game on the Amatek tries. I'm not sure, cause like I actually can't handle it <laughs> having the the proper like horror stuff on the uh, being like playing it. Like I tried playing um, Fear once. I got like 10 minutes in and I was like, yeah. Yeah, I'm out. You know, I can't. I can't handle it. Where are you, bud? Uh, so I can't. I can't handle scary. Um, I was watching Umbrella Academy and uh, minor, like, uh, minor, 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 minor spoilers for Umbrella Academy. Minor season one spoilers. Um, but one of the characters can speak with the dead. Oh, yeah. Uh, and when they show it, and he's like speaking with the, the ghosts and all of that, and the, the ghosts are kind of uh, freaking him out, it's, it would also really, really mess me up. Um, it's, uh, it, I had trouble sleeping after watching season one, because I binged most of season one in one day. Uh, and it was like 2 a.m. or 3 a.m. or whatever when I finished. I had trouble sleeping that night for sure. But I just I can't I can't do scary. I don't like scary and me don't mix. And uh, yeah, I don't know. It's just uh, it, I don't do well with uh, with scary. Even if it's like like if you mildly try to scare me in a in a movie or a TV show or something like that, like you're gonna succeed. If it, if it's trying to be mildly scary, it's gonna succeed because I just I can't handle. The, the scary. It uh, gets me. I don't know. I have like, um, I get really immersed in, in stories and like TV shows and games and, and movies and anime and books and, you know, whatever other kind of media you want to throw at me. Like, I get super immersed into it. Um, so when like scary stuff is happening, like, it's, it's I don't know. I, I can't separate myself from the scary, you know? Does that makes sense? And it's, it's, it really messes with me, so. It's, uh,. It's pretty bad, but I mean that's that's what it is, right? That's 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 their goal. So I'm sure they're happy with uh, with being able to scare me so badly, right? But it's it really really gets me. So um, scary games, really really bad for me. Alien Isolation, you know, like I know that uh, some people do. I know that, uh, like, I watched CoStar back in the day. I was actually one of CoStar's first viewers, believe it or not. I don't watch them anymore, but I'm gonna, I'm gonna flex on that. I was, I was, I was, uh, I'm a, I'm a, I'm a hipster CoStar viewer. I liked him before he was cool. <laughs> um, but, I, uh, he does, um, stream a day, right? Or at least he did. I don't know anymore because I don't watch him anymore. He does, uh, he does stream a day. 
And uh, back in the day, in October, he would like rebrand it to Scream a Day, and he'd play horror games every day instead of just streaming every day, right? Um, so it'd be, it'd be Scream a Day, and uh, that's that's something that just I I I'm I'm in awe that he could do it because he'd play like for the entire month of October for the the Halloween theme, you know? He would do uh, he would do exclusively horror games on it and play through like all these terrifying games, and like. I'm the kind of person who watching somebody else play through a scary game is is like also terrifying to me. Like I couldn't watch it during night, like and that's when he would mostly stream, so like I couldn't watch him uh, at night. I'd have to wait until the uh, the VODs went up in the in the in the daytime and uh, and watch them then. Cuz I just I couldn't watch it at night. So scream a day kind of thing is not something that I'll be doing with my stream, but We'll, uh, we'll see how it goes, anyway. I've got, uh... I've got to figure out what I'm going to be playing on the stream, because we are going to be streaming in, uh... Well, it's August. August has 31 days, right? I think so. Yeah. So, 9 days, 10 days I start streaming. Um, every day, 5 days a week. Not every day, I guess, but 5 days a week, anyway. I move over to my, uh, my proper scheduled lifestyle hopefully it's uh, hopefully it works would be would re really 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 be nice if, uh, if it works and I end up building an audience and do it for a living that would be fantastic I think I can it might take a few months maybe a year but I think I think we'll get there um, but I have no idea what I'm gonna be playing so I want to do like runescape is gonna be most of the the content so probably Tuesdays and like Thursdays we'll do some kind of they're all gonna be alliterations, right? So that's 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 the goal. Is for each day to be an alliteration, right? So we have Friday Factorio. We have um like Monday Monster Hunter maybe. Maybe Monster maybe Monday Monster Mayhem, and I'll play Monster Hunter World. Or Monster Hunter of some sort if I ever get uh like Monster Hunter Generations. And eventually it might change as well, right? Like I'm not I'm not setting it in stone. That uh, it's definitely gonna be Monster Hunter World for for mon for Mondays, but um, I'm guessing it'll probably be Monster Hunter of some sort for Mondays for now. Anyway, I do want to play Monster Hunter World. I'm having a, uh, I'm having my uh, my 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 cravings for Monster Hunter, so we'll, uh, we'll probably do that. Tuesdays are probably going to be like Tuesday. I don't know. I have to think up some kind of uh, an alliteration for Tuesdays. Uh, that'll be probably RuneScape related, and then Thursdays will also probably be RuneScape related. Um, so we'll probably do PVM on Tuesdays and then maybe some PVM on Thursdays or maybe do some PVM on Tuesdays and some Slayer or like skilling on Thursdays, questing, whatever. I have, I've got two accounts that I play on and, uh, I've got, I've got two accounts that I play on in, uh, in RuneScape. I've got my, uh, my main and then my iron. So we'll be playing on both of those. Um, and then uh, we'll probably do like... Tuesdays for the main, Thursdays for the Iron Man, maybe? I don't know. Um, Wednesdays will probably be the, the week that I check out a game that I want to play. So, like, starting off, we might be doing, um, like, uh, Yuppie Psycho, or maybe we'll do some Final Fantasy or, or something. And that'll kind of be a, uh, a game that changes and if we eventually get people watching and there's actually like uh, an audience it might make it um, so that uh, like people can vote on a game to play and then I'll, I'll play whatever game they decide on um, although I'll have the uh, the final say in it for sure because sometimes I might just not want to play the game that they say um, but I might, I might have like a choice of games and then they pick which one as well I don't know that, that that's something that depends on if we have um, an audience. So I can't really I can't really plan around that right now. So it'll just be uh, whatever game I'm feeling like playing. And like an audience of like three isn't an audience enough to, to do that kind of stuff. It's not. You know, I'll, I'll I'll still be doing my own thing. Like I'm talking like once I get an audience of like at least a few hundred people or at least at least a hundred people, I might give uh, the audience the power. But when there's just like I don't know five ten people, which um, I'm probably gonna be able to get pretty quickly. Um, 
I'm not expecting there to be too much uh, with regards to uh, to that, to, uh, to any kind of like audience choice or any kind of um, interaction stuff like that. Um, just because I don't, I don't think it's, I don't think that personally, I don't think it's as fun um, to give three people a choice as it is to give like a hundred people a choice. I think I'd rather just pick it myself. You know, so. But um, yeah. So I'll have uh, Mondays Monster Mayhem, Tuesdays. The Monday Monster Mayhem, the Tuesday. Tonster Tayham, I don't know. The Wednesday. With whatever? I don't know. Like, you know, like, uh, the Wednesdays with whatever? I don't know. Like, it. it who cares? Um. I'll have, to, I'll have to think of some some alliterations for it, but uh, the Friday Factorio fun, the Friday fun pack, the 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 fun for the the Friday the fun pack, the fun Factorio Fridays maybe, or the Friday. I do want it to be three words long, and then have uh, the same letter at the start of them all, the same consonant sound at the start of them all. So it's an alliteration, right? You know, you know how that's, uh, that's how the alliterations work. So I'll, have to, I'll have to think those up. I have uh, I've done a little bit of thought on them, but. We'll have, to, we'll have to see. I do want them to be alliterations because I love my alliterations. Um, and then, uh, yeah, so it'll be two days a week of RuneScape because that's my mainstream game. So Tuesdays and Thursdays we'll be streaming RuneScape. Uh, Mondays we'll be streaming Monster Hunter of some sort. I do want to do Monster Hunter Generations Ultimate. I have that on the Switch. I can't stream the Switch, though. I don't have a capture card. Um, and I, besides, I don't even have my own Switch, so I wouldn't be able to do that because uh, my sister also plays on it. Uh, so for now, it'll probably just be Monster Hunter World. If I even decide to go with that, we might end up doing, like, Monday, Mainscape, whatever's, I don't know, like, another M word. Um... So there's 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 uh, there's still some decisions to be made. If you guys have any ideas, like let me know, and uh, I might I might implement them. Uh, no promises, but that's that's the kind of that's the kind of idea. So Monday Monster Hunter, Tuesday and Thursday Runescape, Wednesday will be a whatever stream, uh, Friday will be a Factorio stream. The Friday might change from Factorio because three hours a week every week on on Factorio maybe a little bit much. I might move the Factorio for now to the Wednesday, so that it's it's just a part of the the game that I play for for funsies for right now, and then um, make the Friday some other kind of thing. I'm unsure if I want the the Friday the, the Factorio to have like a semi permanent spot or not. You know, I'm unsure. So we'll I'm still I'm still fleshing stuff out. Um, but there is going to be structure to the streams. Different days will have different things happening. Um, so there, there, there won't be any two days where we do the exact same thing. We might do PVM on two different... Like, we might do RuneScape PVM on two different days. But it'll be Mainscape and then Ironscape. It won't be the, uh, the same character doing PVM with the same gear. It might be the different characters doing uh, PVM with the same gear eventually. Once my iron gets to that point. But um, different characters... Different, uh, you know, whatnots. So that might happen eventually. For now, it'll definitely it'll be like at least a year before my uh, my my iron has caught up to my main. In uh, with regards to the the gear that it has, because I've got I don't know my my uh, my main is worth like 1.6 bill, 1.7 bill is the as uh, the total wealth on my main. The total I'm gonna use the wealth evaluator. That's what I've got. Plus I got like 200. And, 200, 200 mil in the soften and slayer chest and you know like there's uh it's i have a lot of like stuff <laughs> so i got like dual ascensions with all t80 armor nox staff you know like amulet of souls luck of the dwarves grace of the elf i've got expensive stuff i'm not super end game i don't have like you don't have a scythe. I don't have kopeshes. I don't have tier 92s. But I'm I'm continuing to progress as my iron progresses. So like you know it's gotta eventually 
I'll get in tier 92s, and I might have tier 90s by that point, but it still won't be caught up on the Iron Man. You know what I mean? Anyway, it doesn't matter. The point is, my, uh, the two RuneScape streams will be focusing on different accounts and uh, progressing the different accounts. And it might not necessarily be PVM every single time, so we might some days do uh, some Slayer or Skilling on, on accounts or whatever. It'll probably be PVM for the most part on Tuesdays, because that's going to be the mainscape days. And I'd like to have an excuse to go and do some PVM. Um, but on the iron, I've got just a billion different things that I can be working on. Uh, whereas on the, the main, I don't, I don't have too much that I can be working on still. Um, not not much that I can do actively anyway. I've got a, I've got a bit of questing left. Um, I've got some like livid farm. But I'm probably going to be doing a uh, merchant for that. I've got... Uh, a couple, a couple of things that are active that I can be doing, but for the most part, what I have left to do is pretty AFK. Like Slayer, I want to get to 120. Um, I can do some Dungeoneering. I can do some like ED2 or ED1. Or ED3. I can do full ED3 runs, but I feel like ED3 is a little bit outside my uh, my ability. We can do Telos, Rax, you know. But... um. There isn't an awful lot left on my account that I uh, that I have to do that isn't that I wouldn't prefer to AFK anyway because I've got like um, fishing. You know, you can do fishing actively, but I'd rather just AFK it. I can do smithing. You can do smithing active, but I'd rather AFK it. Um, I've got uh, fletching. Yeah, you can do fletching fairly fairly actively. Um, but again, I'd rather. Just, um, AFK it. So, I'm uh, big into the AFK when it's possible. I would rather spend less time playing RuneScape and uh, and more time doing other things if it's, if it's possible. Like, you know, it might take longer to get something done, but if I'm able to focus on other things and, and be productive while I'm making progress in RuneScape, that's, like, you know, pretty good. So... To me, I, I prioritize the AFK. So there isn't uh, there isn't an awful lot left that I would that I'd be doing actively, other than like PVM, which I do quite like, uh, and a couple of skills in questing. Uh, but I'd have to be like working towards like master quest cape stuff or comp cape stuff, you know, if I was gonna be doing active stuff, which is fine. I'm um, dungeoneering, of course. I think I said that. Um, anyway, we'll. Uh, I don't know why I upgraded this instead of the deagles. It's okay though. They don't make them like that anymore. I'll, uh, I'll I'll figure something out for it. It might not necessarily always be PVM, but largely PVM. And then the iron on Thursdays will be uh, probably um, whatever. Like not necessarily PVM every time. Because, I mean, the iron, you have to do, like, a lot of extra stuff, right? Like, once I get invention on the iron, I have to do a lot of divination to get charges. I have to do... There's a lot of stuff to do on the iron. Um, so I have to get uh, archaeology up pretty quickly. But I have to get invention before I do that, per like, preferably. Um, like, uh, like uh, archaeology helps a lot with divination. Um, it makes it, like, a fairly active skill. But it's it's way faster. So when it comes to like an iron and getting uh, divination charges to, to power your gear, um, that's that's a valuable trade for me. And it's still reasonably AFK. But anyway, that's enough of the other uh, RuneScape stuff. I have no idea what I'm going to be playing. Is the is the moral of the story for the. Uh, for the Friday stream, it's it's still up for for debate. I'm th I'm thinking the more I think about it, the more I th I like putting F uh, Factorio on the Wednesday stream with the other uh, whatevers. The Wednesday with whatevers, I like that because I don't I don't know if I want to give Factorio like a, a long term spot, right? Factorio is more of a, a short term thing for me. Uh, Terraria as well could be there. You might have thought that we do Terraria on Tuesdays with the alliteration, you know. But uh, it's not going to be on Tuesdays because Tuesdays are for RuneScape. 
I'm excited to get into Monster Hunter World. I have not played it at all, although I have um, seen it played quite a lot. Oh, come on, dude. We're not even going to get one win today? <sighs> that sucks. That's, 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 that's rough. So, I don't know. Lots to, lots to think about. I gotta get me. I gotta make artwork and like all kinds of stuff for the stream. I'm not prepared for it at all yet. I've still got like ten days or whatever before it has to happen, but I'm not prepared at all. So let's see about goodness. I'll see about commissioning some people to get uh, some stuff done. I guess I don't know. Anyway, that is going to do it for today. Thank you for watching. Remember to like the video if you like it. Subscribe to see more in the future. Comment if you have anything to say. And I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.